Good morning, Kent County. Thank you all so much for being here for this auspicious occasion. Um, and I have asked two friends to start us off with, as they say in Fiddler on the Roof, a blessing on the house. Please welcome Reverend Claire Nevin Field from Emanuel Church, Chestertown, and Reverend Bobby Brown from Bethel AME. Thank you, John. It's such a privilege and a blessing to be here this morning. Today we gather to launch this amazing new space, the product of so many years of hopes and dreams, work, courage, sweat, tears, and love. And we are thankful for those who dreamed this dream, those who worked tirelessly to raise funds and make the dream come true. Dear God, the creator and architect of this vast universe, which includes Kent County, the smallest county in the state of Maryland, wherein historic, scenic, beautiful Chestertown is lodged. We give thanks to you because you alone are God. You have allowed us to enter into another season of spring and blessed us with this day. Um, it's important to know that this building represents an incredible public-private partnership. And funding from the state of Maryland was very real and very necessary to make this happen. In total, $1,040,000 came in the form of grants from the state of Maryland. That's from the Department of Housing and Community Development, which is done directly through the town of Chestertown. So to the mayor and council of Chestertown, I thank you. And to Case Des Moines, I know that you are in Denmark right now, but we never would have gotten those grant applications done without you. So God bless you too. The second set of funding from the state came through the incredibly important Maryland Heritage Areas Authority and our own heritage area, Stories of the Chesapeake, Gail Owings, thank you. And the final piece of that puzzle from the state came from our two extraordinary representatives, Senator Steve Hershey and the man I introduce now, Delegate Jay Jacobs. It's uh, certainly a, a great day to be here despite the weather uh, to see this uh, wonderful building finally open, you know, for. For some of us have seen this building our entire lives and to see what's happened to it now is really extraordinary and, and I couldn't be happier. You know, I love to see structures renovated and, and uh, to see what's happened here is uh, it's just a, a real asset to the town of Chestertown and Kent County. Kent County, Maryland proclamation. We're here today to proclaim Vincent and Leslie Pr Prince Raymond Day on March the 25th, 2023. And the proclamation reads as, as, as whereas Vincent and Leslie Prince Raymond dedicated 50 plus years of service to the people of Kent County through the arts and by their founding of the Kent County Arts Council in 1975, and their leadership of that Arts Council for more than 40 years. And whereas, with their unmatched dedication to equitable representation and access to the arts for all, and whereas they forced, formed Actors Community Theater in 1984 and produced countless community theater productions, and whereas they nurtured a broad family of artists, musicians, craftspeople, Produce, produces and artisans with ongoing contributions to the community. My name is Stephen Scared Davis. I represent the, the Maryland State Arts Council. 
Um, but I bring greetings from Governor Wes Moore, First Lady Dawn Moore, and the Secretary of Commerce, uh, Kevin Anderson. The Maryland State Arts Council is part of the Department of Commerce, and we believe very firmly that uh, the arts are transformative, and that every person needs and deserves access to the arts. And that's what we do in our daily work. We provide funding to arts organizations and artists across the state to ensure that access, because we know that the arts impact health, they impact education, they impact um, so many uh, areas of our lives, our economies, etc. This stunning portrait by David Schumann of Leslie and Vince. So, uh, does Leslie have the scissors? I'm working on it. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting it through. All right. You are. You are the. All right. Okay. Leslie, are you ready? I was. <laughs> yeah, of course. She's reminiscing about her dance students. <laughs> It is a thrill to finally and at last open the Leslie and Vince Raymond Cultural Center! Yeah, please do. I mean, eventually on our website there will be a The new Gospelites. 